We are again on the JSK TV here in Chingora. We thank God for his mercies that endure forever. Scriptures say, restore our fortunes, O Lord, like streams in the Negev. Those who sow in tears will reap in, I mean, with songs of joy. He who goes out weeping, carrying seed to sow, will return with songs of joy, carrying sheaves with him. I'm so happy today. I have one of my sons in the faith, Pastor Elvis Chipoka, who is the presiding pastor of our branch in Indola. Welcome to today's interview, man of God. No, thank you so much, Bishop. How are you doing? I'm okay, and how are you doing? I'm blessed. What about thank your you. family? No, the family is okay. Uh huh. Yes. Um, I read this scripture because I yes. have seen that uh, you have sacrificed for quite a long time. Every Sunday or Saturday, you are on the road mm -hmm. trekking to and from Mundola. Yes. And indeed, your labor, I believe, is not in vain yes. because we can see results. Mm -hmm. So, what can you tell us about Ndola Church? Ndola Church, yeah. A lot of things is uh, uh, happening in Ndola. Mm. Yeah. Uh, first and foremost, maybe I can uh, say we, uh, where we are. We are in Ndola, uh, located at uh, Rehabilitation Center, which is just next to Levi Mwanawasa Stadium. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we are in the hall there, in the main hall. Okay. Yes. So, our services starts at 10 hours. So now we have seen God from the time we started. Uh, it has been now three years, I think, mm -hmm. uh, after you relaunched the, that branch. Mm -hmm. uh, and after that, I think we have seen a lot of things happening, a lot of miracles happening. Mm -hmm. I believe one of the things you said when we were there, when you were opening, you said, no, the things that I move in, those are the things that will be happening here in Indola. That is one of yes. the things, man of God, I've observed yes. about you. Uh, mm. Sacrificially, you know, uh, you you spend your own money yes. going to and from uh, Ndola. Yes. And uh, you pray for sick people. Yes. Uh, you yes. cast out devils. Yes. And we hear testimonies happening yes. Yes. right about there. Yes. So uh, the anointing that mm. you honor yes. will begin to honor you. Yes. That's what okay. the Bible, uh, I mean, not the Bible, that's what we learn mm. from the men and yes. the women in the Bible. Mm. Those who honored mm. Moses, yes. you know, the anointing on Moses honored them. Yes. Those who honored Elijah, mm. the anointing on Elijah yes. honored them mm. as well, and etc. etc. I want to say this that. Uh, mm. Uh, your services are not in vain. Amen. So yes. right up in Indola, mm. uh, you're saying you are at uh, the rehabilitation yes. center yes. just next to yeah. the, uh, the uh, yeah, uh, Levi Manawasa Stadium, Stadium yes. in yes. the main hall, yes. you know, mm. and the service is starting at 10, 10 hours. Yes. What type of people are supposed to be there? Uh, I think all, uh, all kinds of people. Mm. Yeah, those that, uh, that need crust. Uh, they can come. These who are, who, uh, yeah, even these believers who do not have anywhere mm. to go, mm. they can come. Yeah, even those people that are sick, maybe they do not have, uh, yeah, they, they have tried to go to other places and nothing is happening. Mm. We, we also invite them. They can come to that place. Mm. We'll pray for them and I believe the, uh, the Holy Spirit will surely mm. deliver them. Mm. Yes. So yeah, uh, we can say just everyone is most welcome to that place indeed you are so welcome every one of you you know yes. to the rehabilitation center mm. in indola next to levi mwanawasa stadium and our services begin at 10 hours in the main hall mm. you know various issues you know only god can solve the issues that you are going through. So we, we know that uh, uh, sometimes uh, uh, people walk by sight and God expects us to walk by faith because faith pleases God. Nothing is impossible with God. So man of God, now yes. we are under the period of COVID-19 yes. uh, COVID and, uh, and uh, um, there are a lot of restrictions yes, yes. Uh, which the authorities have mm. put forth. One of them is that we need to, to be putting on masks. Yes. We we need to be uh, washing our hands yes. uh, with soap and hygienic waters mm. and also social distances. Yes. Are you doing these things in Indol? Yes, we are actually doing that. Uh, yes, the people, we are encouraging them every time to put on masks when they're there. Mm. We have a one meter distance in between the, the, the seats. Mm -hmm. Yes, we have uh, yeah, uh, the, the buckets just at the entrance as people enter. 
then we also have a register, the register. because we need uh, in case we had we have someone uh, with uh, covid Mm -hmm. It will be easier for them to trace such to a person. Yes. Up, yes. Mm. So no hugging. No, no hugging, no shaking. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, how are the people coping? Are they appreciating it or they are not happy uh, with it? It's a little bit difficult <laughs> at the moment. <laughs> yeah, yeah, especially in the worship service. Yeah. Yeah, because people cannot sing with masks. Yeah, so it's <laughs> a bit difficult, but uh we believe that by the message of God, maybe these things will, <laughs> will disappear soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I would want to think yeah. that uh, it's quite challenging everywhere yes. where yeah. we are meeting, not only in Life Gospel Fellowship, yes. Ministry Church International, yes. but all other churches and all other assemblies, they are yes. affected by the same thing. Yes, yes, we are right. hoping that the authorities will review these things quite soon yeah. and uh, they bring us something else. Yes, yes. So, yes. um um, our vision is loving God and those whom God loves. So, how are you doing it in Indola? Um, especially that uh, um, uh, where the church is, it's a bit of outskirts. That is in uh, that place is called what? Uh, that is the, uh, it's in between Ilcrest and the Dollar E. Oh, between yes. Hillcrest uh, and Dora Hill. Then Mutengo, somewhere there. Uh -huh. uh, that is where we are. Yes. So mm. I'm told also you provide transport? Yes, we provide transport. From where to where? Uh, I think just from, uh, we start from Pamozi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, then uh, 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 through to Lubuto. Mm -hmm. Yeah, then Tuapia. And uh, except Chifuvu, we haven't yet started. Okay. But most of these areas to uh, yeah, through town, going to Lubuto and those areas within there. Mm. So yeah. if someone wants to come, let's yes. say they are coming from uh, mm. uh, 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 Tuapia. Oh, yes. How do they identify this kind of uh, transport you have put there? Okay. Uh, for those that are coming for the first time, yes. we encourage them first to come to church. They come they, on their yes, own. Yes, they come on their own. Uh, then afterward, we introduce explain. them. Yes. yes. Then we introduce to them to the people that are responsible with this transport. Mm -hmm. Then they get even their numbers. Okay. Yes. So when the bus is going back, mm -hmm. they take them. They drop okay. them at the, say, at the station where they're dropping. All right. So from All right. there, they know that next Sunday I have to be there and they tell them the time. Mm. Yeah, so they exactly know that, okay, the, the, the type of a bus that will come at this time, it's this. Mm. Yes. So, mm. ladies and gentlemen, we are uh, Life Gospel Fellowship, mm. Ministry Church International. Mm. I'm talking to the resident pastor of our branch in Indola, mm. uh, Pastor Elvis Chipoka, my son in the faith, a man of God. Mm. I love him so much. Our vision, like you heard, is loving God and those whom God loves. We endeavor to live the word of God, to walk by faith and not by sight, also to live in the spirit and walk in the spirit. Mm -hmm. So maybe you have challenges and uh, you didn't know that uh, we have a branch. This man of God that you are seeing here with me is attested with signs and wonders. Miracles are happening through his ministry. The call is very, very strong upon him. I would want you to take his number, his telephone number, and call him so that you make arrangements. We are inviting you to start coming to attend services at the rehabilitation center in the main hall. Rehabilitation center is just next to Levi Mwanawasa uh, Stadium. So man of God, tell your number. You look into the camera there okay. and tell your number. Uh, yes. Read it twice or three times. Okay. Yeah, so my number is uh, 966 so zero nine six six eight nine three three nine nine. Once again, oh nine six six eight nine three three nine nine. That is my number. That number is also seen on the monitor. You see, please call it. And uh, that is a church where I'm a presiding bishop, and I'm found there. And uh, if you want to know the time when I can be found there, you check up with our pastor. So, man of God, thank you for coming to this interview. We are hoping and trusting and believing God that even in the time of restrictions like the COVID-19, you know, the church is going to prosper. Yes. You know, people will come. Yes. And as many as shall come, you know, we, we teach them the gospel. Yes. The gospel is the power of God unto salvation to everyone who believes, to the Jew first, then to the Greeks. 
In it, the righteousness of God is revealed from faith to faith, as it is written that they just shall live by faith. So I speak multiple blessings upon you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, and also upon every member of our church and those who will be coming to join. Amen. I can tell you there will be exponential growth Amen. sooner than we realize. Amen. Thank be blessed. Amen. Shalom. Amen. Thank you. Okay. If you need to be prayed for by the man of God, Bishop Joseph A. Skajila, you are encouraged to attend the live services in Chingola at the Life Cathedral. You can also call the following numbers in Chingola 0969-304830, or in Lusaka, you can also call 0965-476972, 0965-476972.